Lawmakers say most of the illegal synthetic drug fentanyl that has killed so many Americans is manufactured and smuggled into the U.S. from China. Looking to crack down on it, Republican Senator Patrick Toomey of Pennsylvania, the Senate Democratic leader Chuck Schumer, and others have joined together to sponsor the Fentanyl Sanctions Act. News Channel 34's Morgan Wright reports it would put pressure on the Chinese government to follow through and stop the deadly flow of fentanyl into the U.S. at its source. Fentanyl's been absolutely devastating to Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania Senator Patrick Toomey says he wants the illegal drug off the streets. In Pennsylvania, 70% uh, of all fatal drug overdoses, the victim has some amount of fentanyl in their system. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says fentanyl has claimed the lives of more than 28,000 Americans since 2017. We know exactly where this drug is predominantly coming from, China. Senator Chuck Schumer says that's why lawmakers have introduced the Fentanyl Sanctions Act. First ever legislation to give broad and powerful sanction tools to the administration. Lawmakers say the legislation would go after China and any country that does not crack down on producers and traffickers of the deadly drug. Florida Senator Marco Rubio says China has failed to respond appropriately to fentanyl in the past. It's for one simple reason, and that is the people who are doing this, who are manufacturing this, and handing it off to traffickers are making a lot of money. But the lawmakers are encouraged that this time China will comply. China is now going to ban the entire class, the entire category, so all of fentanyl. Senator Toomey says China's promise, along with the potential sanctions of this legislation, might help loosen the deadly grip of the drug on our nation. In Washington, Morgan Wright.